Okay guys, so I kind of want to explain this a little bit better. Um, the location of the batteries is was a little bit difficult for this project because you have to make it removable because um, batteries going to constantly get going flat over a period of weeks. Um, depends on how long you use this. Um, so what I'm going to do is the same overall um, schematic as the needler. I'm going to have the batteries as well as a um, power in so you can when it's stationary you can actually power it into the wall um, via this bit so the speaker is actually located here which is this piece and that's uh, I chose the best spot for it because that's where it's most hollow in the whole um, piece which will give it great sound or sound a bit more like a toy um, yeah, so here is the batteries and where they will be located in the handle. So, I've created uh, three false screws. Um, uh, j they're just for show. Once it's cast in smooth cast 320 and painted them up gold, um, corresponding to the paint job on the ray gun depending on what version, um, it should look uh, well blended in to the real one. So, and I created a notch here, so it's uh, relatively easy for the people to know and also grab um, that piece when you're removing the batteries. Um, gives it a bit more of a uh, um, reference to which side the batteries are on. So, simply enough, undo the real screw uh, screwdriver, simple and once you got the real screw aside um, also when I do cell cast to the ray gun I'm actually going to give out um, a spring for the trigger and the actual screw that you need to match the other screws so don't be worried and grab through that little notch just use something small just to pin it and then you slowly wiggle it out because there's actually a notch there that is actually lines up with this one just to help keep the bottom in place since there is no um, screw at the bottom here so the main thing holding it on is this screw and this tab so you gotta be careful not to break this so that's why it's always be careful because once this is cast in Smith Cast 320, um, it will be a bit more durable, but to a certain extent. And the batteries will be placed in there. This is the battery holder that will go in there. Then simply enough to close it back up once you put new batteries in. Line it up with the notch, and put it in, and then the screw. Yeah. And that's simple. That's how the that's where the batteries are gonna be located. Very awesome. <laughs> okay then, catch you guys in the next vid.